Hey guys, how you doing? I'm doing good. I just had problems with my good camera though. It, uh, it's so full of data and videos in there, so I have to switch to my older camera. And this camera is going to shut off the the um, the light is. So that's okay because then I'll just let it cool off because it gets hot. Okay, so I have just did this and um, my board was too thick. So this is a board I bought, a little plaque I bought. And see how it's woody? Just a pure wood plaque, that's all it was. Really nicely sanded down. And then it came with this little hook that goes right up in here. So I think it's just perfect. It's like about a 5 by 7 And I think it's perfect for what I want to do. I've seen a lady do um, this today. Well, I didn't see her do it. I see she posted the picture of it. And she's using... I asked her what color she used. She said burnt umber and gold that was it so beautiful together so you're probably getting dizzy right now what I'm doing is I'm putting my burnt umber on but I am going to pause it while I let it just sit here and drip as thin as it can get. Okay? That's what I'm going to do. I need it to get really thin. Okay, so I tilted it for a long time. I think this is a little bit thick. Could have been a little thinner. so Because it, it dripped for so long. It's just a little thick. So you want your base coat thin. Well, not the paint thin, thin. You want to be able to tilt off as much as you can until it's not dripping anymore. But anyway, that was uh, the two parts flow troll, one part paint, and just a little water with burnt umber for my base coat. Now I'm using only metallic gold for the flower. A beautiful chain pull I seen her do with these colors and I'm like wow those colors are beautiful together but I did notice in the camera the gold is not showing up it's showing up white <laughs> so we'll see anyway I mixed my metallic gold with just water and it's not real thin either. Okay, it's not real, real thin. I think it's okay. I think it was my board that was too thick. So, hopefully you can see. I have to check. Oh, no, you can't even see. Put my chain in. I'll just show you this once, that way you know what I'm doing. Put it in there. Let it get full of that gold, metallic gold. It's beautiful. It's just, you can't see it in the camera. It looks white. So I'm going to have it go through my fingers. But I'm not pinching my fingers really hard. And the reason I'm not using Floetrol for the flowers, only for the base coat, is because I get cells. So, here we go. I went through my fingers twice. Maybe that wasn't... You know what? Maybe I should just go one time. Maybe that was the problem last time. Alright, I'm just going to have it go once through my fingers. <clears throat> 
because they just kind of disappeared on me a little. The flowers did, but I was thinking it was my base coat too thick. We'll see. All right. Now you probably won't be able to see this because my hands can. It's the camera is right over my head. Hand. I'm just going in that kind of messed up on my top flower a little. It wasn't real small. Did it a little too big. That's all right though. Okay. So it doesn't have to be perfect. You know, this I wanted to be a little shorter, but that's okay. So I'm going to let it just sit there for a few seconds and let that gold soak in there. But yeah, the last time I did it twice through my fingers. And I think it's just that I actually believe that the burnt umber was a little too thick. Because it just took forever to drip off the, the board. Okay, here we go. Oh, that's pretty. I hope you can see the gold, because I know you can't. It's just pretty against that brown. So now I'm just wiping my, um, through my dry gray, dipping it back into my gold again. It's not disappearing either, is it? Right on. And I'm going to just go through my fingers one time this time again. Maybe that's what it was. I didn't have enough paint on there. Whoa, got caught on my finger. So it's at the same time. Maybe the last one, because that's not disappearing this time. Only on this one it did a little bit. I always put my fingers here to stay in line. There we go. Done. So pretty. Just hope the next one stays. <clears throat> Gonna be a pretty little plaque. I really like the way the girl did her flowers. They were different, and I'm gonna do that sometime too. But since this one was so small, I'll just do what I normally do. But it's just so shimmery and gold. But I noticed in the last video that I was doing, it's white in the camera. So that's a real bummer. And I was using my good camera too. It was just... It was just doing that because it's so bright. The, the flash is so bright. Mm. 
I know my hand is in the way. The only way I could do this, I guess, would be on the side angle. But I think you get the idea. Pretty simple. This paint, you don't want real thin. You want this paint a little bit thicker than this paint, your base paint. Definitely drip off that paint. You cannot have this thick. Or these will disappear. They'll sink in like mud. This gold is so pretty with this. Oh, yeah, it's the same color, too. Yes. All right. So now if these don't show up real good, that's okay, because these are just the little dainty petite ones I like. Got to add a little bit more to it. So I'm putting it in there. I'm going to run through my fingers again, one time. Just do a small one here. Scares me because it looks like a lot of gold coming off that chain. There we go. Well, it's kind of thick because I like them real thin, petite, and delicate. That's the way I like them. I don't like them real gaudy. You know what I mean? Bulky. Don't like them that way. But I think this one's going to be bulky. So I better take it off early. Good. I could stop there, but I'm not gonna, I'm gonna do one on each side now. I'm surprised the light's still on. Better not say anything, it'll turn off as soon as I do. Oh, did I mention when, when you put it in your, your chain in there? Then if you're doing it twice. You wipe your fingers off before you, anytime. You wipe your fingers off before you go over your canvas or your board. That one I kind of went twice because I don't want it too thick over here. That's what's good. That's why you want to do it the same way every flower. You know? I did go twice on these on the end because it's getting thicker now. The paint is, that's all. Right on, guys. 
guys, we did it. <clears throat> it's a nice one, too. Oh, that light was just shining away. I apologize for this camera. I was anxious to try these colors. So it's gold, guys. Just think of it as gold. <laughs> I know it looks white. Oh, there. So it has to cool down. Now you can see the gold, see? Isn't that crazy? Isn't that pretty though? Alright, so we'll just um I'll let that cool off and I'll be right back. Well, I'll tell you what, that's about the worst video I've seen. <laughs> Well, I woke up this morning. I gave up last night because the camera light kept going off. I woke up this morning and it's dry. Because, yeah, like I said, you want to have your. You want this real thin. Because then your chain will sink in. But. Well, now you can at least see it because I have no light shining on it like it was. That is just terrible. I'm sorry. But I want to show it to you because it was so pretty. I just love this gold with that burnt umber. So I plan on making a big one like that girl did. I want to do a nice big one with these two colors because it's just beautiful. But here it is up close through the sunlight, natural light. And I know my hand was in the way the whole time. <laughs> it's just real hard to do it. With the camera right over. Next one I do, I have to have somebody hold the camera. So my hand is not blocking everything. But I just love the petiteness. Yeah. The delicateness of it. Turned out good. They're all good. Every flower on there. Turned out pretty. So. I like it. Did get some cells though, see? I didn't even put Floetrol in the paint. The just never fails. Isn't that pretty though? That gold with that. Okay. I thought I would finally just wait it out and show it to you during the light. <laughs> hey guys. I'll talk to you later. Okay. Bye bye. Thanks for watching. I know. Well. It is what it is. Well, just sometimes that light just bleh. Just, just so bright, especially when you're really up close. It does that. Okay, have a good day. I'll catch you later for cooking at Friday. <laughs> <laughs>